One question I am asking you all out there. Who the hell should I name this guy or this girl? Because she was seen for like a split second in Cars on the Road and she didn't even have a name. So if you have any ideas for names, please let me know in the comments. Because I would really love to name her. Anyways, I do know that it's a she because she spoke. I forgot what the line was, though. But she was seen in the Trucks episode. <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> Allergies and stuff. Anywho. Yeah, like I said, she appeared for like a split second from Cars on the Road. And pretty much never seen again. Which is the norm for these guys. So, enough chit chat, let's get into the review of this girl. So, this was made out of a Chris Revstopsky, although the mirrors have fallen off. If I'll try and replace this one, I could. Or try and make another custom. There she is with the green eyes. Forgot to do the eyelids on there. Got the front lights. I know this is not accurate, but still, I'll try and make another one if I get another Chris Revstopsky. The accurate model, that is. Her mouth with her tongue out. The bumper and the grill. This is not going to take long, folks. Alright, so we got another. So we got a white stripe on the side. Yeah, you could tell this was made out of Chris Reb's stop ski because of the white. On the bottom. Got the door there, the tires, they do apparently move. The white stripe is going on to the back there. No license plate, the back lights, just all a nice red color. I tried to accuratize this the best I could. Got the white stripe again, the window. And the back window, the flatbed. Yeah, I should have probably bought a Chris Rostovsky with the accurate model, but who would know? I didn't honestly know that until I watched Cars on the Road again for like the sixth time, I would believe. Made in China, of course. And the base says 1967EAA, made on the 196th day of 2017. And ugh, mine's got some stuff on it. And this was formerly used as a Brick Yardley crew chief, but I decided to scrap that custom. And make this one instead. Yeah, with granted, it's not the most accurate. Yeah. Though I could have done a little bit better, but still. This took a little bit quick, so I'm going to grab them. one of the most similar models out there. We've got... Darn it! You probably just saw him fall off. But... Hold on. Just a moment... It's Dexter Hoover. Or at least for this model. Yeah, she was seen like passing by like this, talking to a big truck. In the segment called, We got your back, we know you're in it for the long haul. Yeah, something, something. For us even if you're small, is what the line was. I completely forgot the, all of the lyrics to it. I'm sorry, I haven't watched it in, like, forever. Cars on the road. Uh. 
And hold on a moment. Versus the model she's actually based off of, Chris Revstopsky. Yeah. I really wish I would have bought an extra Chris to do a custom. That way it would be more accurate, but what you gonna do about it, am I right? But at least Thailand made Chris accurate. So that's a plus. All right, so that is gonna be pretty much it for the custom cars on the road pickup truck scene from the trucks episode. Again, let me know what I should name this girl down in the comments. Because I haven't really thought of any names whatsoever. It's really been a tough, difficult time to find names, especially since Mattel's running out of them. Cough, cough, Mato, Mateo. Enough. Enough, Shifty, enough. So anyways, I shall see you guys on the next Countdown to Christmas review. I'm not going to spoil it. So I'll see you then tomorrow at 8. Goodbye. Thanks for watching. And as always, peace.